Michael Strawn suffered the first of two family tragedies in quick succession when he lost an older sister. Deborah Diana Strawn, who was affectionately nicknamed Ms. D, died at the age of just 58, and an obituary published online suggested that she had been a pillar of her local community for decades. In fact, as a member of the Church of Champions, Deborah had dedicated much of her life to Jesus Christ since her early teenage years. The obituary read, she had a real passion and a love for her family at all times. Deborah was affectionate, energetic, kind-hearted, and she never met a stranger. She would give you the shirt off her back. No matter what may have been going on in her life, she always had a smile. The obituary mentioned Michael, 10 years her junior, alongside their other siblings Sandra, Jean Jr., Christopher, and Victor as well as their mother Louise and father Jean Sr. Interestingly, the former New York Giants defensive end has never spoken about his loss in public. The eulogy concluded, Deborah was full of life, love, joy, and happiness. She will always be in the memory of those who knew her or ever met her. While Michael Strahan hasn't yet addressed the death of his older sister Deborah, he has often spoken publicly about the impact of losing his father. Indeed, just months after Gene Strahan died in 21 and 20, aged 83, his footballing hero son opened up on The Dr. Oz Show about how he was coping. Michael explained that keeping all the well wishes he'd been sent since the devastating news had helped with the grieving process. I'm getting their real emotion at that time and I wanted them to get my real emotion at that time as well. It was great because it brought smiles to my face to see these people think of my father and my family, and it made me think of some great things with my dad. Four years earlier, Michael revealed to people how instrumental his pop had been to his sporting career. The New York Giants star started out on his path to NFL greatness when he was sent from Germany to his Houston-based uncle by Army Major Gene in the hopes of landing a college football scholarship. I didn't know what I was doing, but because my dad never said if or possibly, he said, this is gonna happen, 